I find extreme pleasure in doing research and understanding sort of how the world works. I never thought I would be an entrepreneur. I was born in Ustkaminogorsk, Kazakhstan, which is a tiny little city near Chinese border. When you leave home at 16 and you get on with your studying. I was doing two degrees, one in mathematics in Russia and another one in IT in Finland. And uh, traveling across the border to attend lectures and exams was quite challenging, but a lot of fun. I received the scholarship of a Royal Society of Engineering. It was better than winning national lottery, so I arrived to Leeds and uh, you know, people were open, friendly, international. It was a good environment to be in. I think it was quite unusual for a PhD student to say I'd like to do something commercial with my PhD. It was a massive challenge. Just in my last year, I was fortunate to be the first recipient of the Sir Peter Thompson uh, Enterprise Award. So I won 5,000 pounds, and uh, to be honest, a lot of encouragement from the team around that award. Uh, having somebody who really understands what you do and supports you is so important. So we do clinical trials, imaging clinical trials, but we bring a lot of mathematics and computer science to enhance um, the way the clinical trials are done. And in some way you're doing it for maybe a greater purpose of improving patient health and improving the way we deal with data and information, but you always end out if there is a commercial application. I feel extremely privileged to work with such smart, dedicated people. All of us are united by a single goal that we are doing something extremely important. I think Leeds is an extremely fascinating place. It's full of young, enthusiastic people. And it's such a great source of innovation and inspiration. I have become a judge on the award scheme which Sir Peter originated, and I was amazed by the quality of these businesses. I think everybody creates their own glass ceiling. But if you're an entrepreneur, you just create your own ladder, break the ceiling and go higher and higher.